hello guys in this video i'm going to show you how to monetize your mobile app using caster sdk now this works on android ios windows and linux i'm going to guide you through the integration into your mobile app so first head to castersdk.com and then click on get started now create an account agree to the terms and register now once you register you're going to get a nine dollar bonus so we can just click on create and get nine dollar bonus now enter an app name now for this video we're going to be using a web view app and let's check the application id which is com.example.labs so this is just a basic web view app now let's enter the application name which is etechbox labs android expand app id com.example.labs and then you can enter a website the landing page for your app daily active users and monthly installation create app now let's close this and from here you can see the instruction to actually set up with your app so let's download the sdk package and then copy our client id also click on documents to see the instruction so this is the instruction to integrate caster sdk to your mobile app now let's open our android project so this is our app in android studio let's run a demo so this is just a basic web view app with a navigation menu i'm going to provide the source code in the video description now let's integrate packet sdk now this is a download folder and this is the sdk package we downloaded so let's extract open the extracted folder and then copy caster sdk.aaro go to your project folder etech box labs go to app and then paste it in your libraries folder if you don't have any then create a new folder and call it libs for library open it and paste caster sdk.aaro now we can head back to our browser to get the instruction so first we are going to implement the package we just downloaded and we're going to copy the implementation now head to your app gradu and then under dependencies we are going to paste it and then click on sync now next we have to add internet permission to our app and we can do that in android manifest but we've already done that as you can see in android manifest there is already internet permission so let's head back next we have to create an application and initialize it so let's head to our project folder com.etechbox.labs now we can just click on these options go to appearance and then compact middle packages so under com.etechbox.labs or your project name we can right click and create a new kotlin class let's call this my application create it as a class now we are going to paste everything here so let's just clear everything and just leave the package name paste now we're going to replace this with our client id which we got from caster sdk we also have to import global scope dispatcher and launcher so let's paste that in next we have to declare our application in android manifest now we already have an icon label and the rest of them so we're just going to copy the android name head to our android manifest right here and then paste it under the applications and that is all so basically this is how to integrate caster sdk now we can rerun our application and that is all basically now let's head back to caster sdk on our browser and then head to applications by the left sidebar 
and after a few minutes your app would be showing as integrated and from here you can monitor your app innings and you can also withdraw your balance so basically this is how to integrate caster sdk on your mobile app if this video was helpful kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification thank you for watching and i will see you on the next one